Hi, welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2018 BMW M2 3 litre GCT. The vehicle is presented in sapphire black metallic, has just arrived as a part exchange, is a superb example of the M2. As with any of the cars here at your next car, it is of course physically in stock, ready to be driven away. There are no hidden extras, so how you see the car is how you'll purchase it. If you'd like to know anything more about this stunning example of the M2, please do go ahead and check the description box as I'll leave contact and web links available there for you, including prices, funding options, and of course our easy to use finance calculator can also be found over through our website at any time for you. Or of course, if you prefer, please do get in touch via text, email, WhatsApp, telephone, all of the usual contact routes. But let's get straight into talking about this magnificent M2 BMW. So as I mentioned, the car has come as a part exchange and all of the features you see on the car have been carried out with the previous owner. And they have done a magnificent job of both taking care of the car and also upgrading and taking the maximum potential from this wonderful, wonderful two-door coupe BMW. So it's got the original M2 alloy wheels. Of course, they are very, very similar to this car's bigger brother, if you will, the M4. However, they have just had a overhaul, the same as the tires. So you've got virtually brand new Michelin Pilot Sport 4S tires. Of course, a full BMW spec tire for this car. You'll see it comes with a carbon front splitter and the original M2 kidney grills there it's got the adaptive led headlights has had a front number plate delete although the front number plate is and will be with the car and you'll see that shortly really does give a menacing look however with that front number plate delete with the vehicle the m2 front bumper is a really really beautiful bit of craftsmanship from the m division at bmw down the side you can see the carbon rear arch spats there and again they are a really nice addition to this car just to make it even further menacing the front and rear brakes have also just recently been overhauled roughly around about 500 miles ago including a full service we've got the carbon um, mirrors as you can see there we're going to get a proper chance to have a look through the interior on this car in a few moments there's a lot to talk about on this vehicle and we will get a chance to talk about as much of that as possible however i do recommend reading the advert in full detail you've got the extended carbon rear spoiler on this car and then the same for the rear diffuser that lovely f1 style diffuser with the central f1 light there in full carbon this car has got the BMW M performance exhaust system on the car, which really an M2 isn't quite an M2 without one of those. It makes all of the difference. However, yes, it is an M car and it is a very impressive one, but it still remains a very practical car in terms of you've got that big boot space there. You have also got folding seats. So again, it still can be used every day. This one has got the nice options of front and rear sensors with a reversing camera. And as you can see, the bodywork has been kept in absolutely immaculate condition in that sapphire black. It looks absolutely fantastic. Rear lights have also been slightly tinted, again, just to keep in theme with that very, very menacing look. And again, you'll see all four alloy wheels completely unmarked. And we will go and take our first look inside the car. You've got front and rear privacy glass. Obviously, the front is very, very light indeed. You'd barely notice it was there. Of course, that is removable should you not prefer to have that on there or it's not to your taste. The interior, again, is equal to the exterior in terms of it's been maintained and kept in really nice condition. You've got the 4M leather in here so the both front seats are heated both are electrically operated you've got memory controls for the driver's side you've got this lovely alcantara section on the door card also got the blue m stitch in there it has got the harman card and audio option which every bmw should have that but especially an m car you've got the carbon carbon fiber center top piece to the dash including the center section lower down 
And again, going back to that practicality I was mentioning, in the back it still has its function in terms of the Isofix 2x2 seat arrangement with the central storage tray. It does, of course, have that 7-speed DCT gearbox, which happens to be one of my favourite in terms of how well it performs both on a day-to-day -day basis. But then, of course, this isn't an everyday car in terms of your normal normality. You can use it every day by all means, but of course, when the mood, the time and the place is right, this car can be a totally different animal. Now, in original form, the M2 produces just over 400 brake horsepower. This car has received some performance upgrades. Again, I did write that in the advert. So it has got a bigger upgraded air intake. It's had the intercooler and charge pipe also upgraded to the same manufacturer. So again, to aid in both cooling and of course the better air intake. It has also received a bigger, better, less restrictive downpipe and has also had a ECU remap as well to of course unleash this car's true potential. As of course, when BMW designed this car, they didn't want, quite want it to compete with, as I said, its bigger brother, but it certainly will now. And again, you can hear already straight away that lovely M Performance exhaust. We're gonna go ahead and shut the window just for one second. But again, in here with the window shut, you could easily drive this every day and that exhaust not be too much for you. You have got cruise control, speed limiter, voice and volume functions. You've got the paddles, of course, for that seven speed DCT gearbox. It's only covered just over 37,000 miles. So it's a lovely low mileage example. We have got professional wide nav and media. So that's your nav view. You've got Bluetooth telephone and audio as well as the Apple CarPlay option. So again, I know that's hugely popular at the moment. You've got DAB, music collection, front CD and USB lining, of course. Let's check out the service status. Of course, a really, really important factor to any car that gets to bear the M badge is, of course, the servicing. 11,000 miles till next service. It has had the running in service, as you can see there. It was done on time, hence the green marker next to it. The last service was a full service, including all filters and spark plugs. So again, the car's recently been in, around about 500 miles ago for a full service, full checkup. So it's all service good and ready to go. As I mentioned, rear facing reversing camera. As you can see there, just drop that back out and switch everything back off. I'm not going to be giving this a sound clip just because we do have customers in the showroom. And as I said, with that M Performance exhaust, it is very, very loud when you are both driving the car and, of course, giving it a rev. It makes all of the right noises in all of the right areas and is certainly a car that is well and truly set up. Just before I do finish off the walk around, it is worth mentioning that you may have seen that this car does sit lower than a normal M2. It is sat on IBAC coilovers as well as BIMTEC spacers. So the car has also received suspension work as well as performance and of course audio upgrades in terms of the exhaust system. But it has been done to a very, very high standard and only the best parts have been fitted to really get the true potential out of this car. Because when it was launched, as I say, BMW did sort of cap it as they didn't want it to compete with its bigger brother in terms of the M4 and, of course, the M3 for that matter. But in this car's current form, it certainly will do both of those things, but certainly it can still be used every day as, of course, it was intentionally designed for. Really magnificent example of the M2 3-litre DCT here in stock, ready to go at your next car. If you'd like to know anything more, please do go ahead and check the description box. Well worth a read on the advert. More information in there for you. But thank you. Do take care. Bye-bye.